2025 is going to be exciting in leveraging AI for investments. We have more data than ever available, and that's matched by an incredible increase in computational power given the technological advances in GPU technology. It means that we can unleash large language models to read automatically every day thousands and thousands of documents that are relevant in terms of understanding the behavior of stock markets. So you can read broker reports on a daily basis. You can read all these earning calls, analysis reports, and all this information is going to be used by these AI algorithms and agents in order to fine tune or forecast on stock prices. When navigating Asian markets, the first observation that comes to my mind is that there are lots of opportunities to generate alpha. And the second important observation is that there is a lot of granularity, a lot of different opportunities can, that can be captured to the benefit of investors. If we look, for instance, at Japan, this is a very large market. There's definitely a regain interest from investors. And also there's been reforms driven by the Tokyo Stock Exchange to incentivize companies to be using their cost of capital most efficiently, which is something that we can capture through systematic investing in terms of observing how companies are reacting to that. There's a lot of work that can be done using a systematic approach in assessing how the diversity of, of a board, how the evolution of board members can drive, how the company is going to run, and eventually bringing insights on how specific companies could outperform. If you look at India, there is a willingness from the regulator to force more disclosure on mutual fund holdings, on loans pledging, and this information can be consumed by technology in terms of understanding better how companies are going to be evolving from a price dynamic. And if you look at mainland China, there's a large amount of information that we can extract from financial blogs where using large language models calibrated in local language we can extract sentiment, what are the stocks and the companies that retail investors are talking about, and we can turn that into super useful insights.